Hello you guys, I hope this video goes well and it helps you guys out. So today I will definitely be using the back in the day corset trainer. This here I call Snatch Me Bit, Snatch Me Bit. So yes. If you can put it on yourself, yes, that's still good. But you definitely like to actually get that tug and tight and snatch. You're gonna need somebody help. So here we are. Take these and bend it down. Cause y'all know I'm always having on something, uh, whether it's um, girdle underwear or some type of uh, shaper underwear. That goes for anything. Like I'm always having on something. So that's these are some shaper underwear I had purchased. So as y'all can see, got a little flat up here, whatever. But I am I am gonna corset train today and show y'all if you can put it on yourself. Yes, but still have someone help you for that extra snub. And so. My partner insists to my when you put it on yesterday, I said, yeah, I, I can put it on, but it needs that extra tug. So he complained, and I'm showing y'all that I can actually put it on myself. No, you cannot. Especially if I look. So I gotta come back up so I can put it connected. Let me show y'all so I can actually show y'all how you really got to connect it into the thing. So yeah, I'm bending it down a little bit more so you can see. I'm actually connecting it onto here. I have had this corset trainer since 2015. For those that know me, I have had it for a long time. I actually even, and this is the short torso. So for anyone that's short like me, purchase the short torso. torso Cause if you short and you get the long way, oh, it's going to be very uncomfortable. So remember how we used to do, we're going to go from the top. We're going to go from the top. Let me just show them briefly. When I put my underwear around, you going from the top there? Okay, so can we show them how you're doing it to the side? So you can see, see how right now, it's not, you do um, straighten the arm, the thing that be in the middle. Thank you. My partner here always helps me out. So, where the strings that I got? So what he's gonna do is start from the top. Every time he pulls from the top, I'm gonna, be, I'm gonna be pulling my string. Can y'all see? Okay, yeah, so this right here, you have to actually have it separate. So anytime that he pull from that top, I'm pulling. And then he, it's just like a shoestring. He's gonna eventually bring it all the way down until I can start pulling it. This is a process, I promise you guys. So, um, have I, I haven't did it in, in a while besides these past couple days when y'all see me put it on. What, but, uh, what I'm grabbing right here. Right, I gotta put it. Okay. Yeah, I gotta put it. So he went, he actually went from the bottom already. I'm just show y'all. He actually, I like to keep holding my string. I went from the top. Oh, so we do the bottom yet? No. Okay. So he's still going from the top. Unless that's, could that, is that, right. that's tight enough for you. No, I want to see if you can do it super tight, really. Right, yeah, that's, so every time he pull, every time he pull, I'm pulling. And so, am I doing the top, top one? You see how when he let it go, how I was pulling? I think that's good. All right, so look, now I hold these two. You see how I got these two at the top? What I'm gonna do is come from the bottom. Good. Yeah, I'm gonna come from the bottom. I'm still holding my strings. And watch how I pull it. The bottom strings, I'm gonna just pull. You see how I just did that? So, he got my bottom, he got my top. I can't really see y'all. Is it all the way closed in, baby? Come show it, come point to it. If you got that top part still gap, you might wanna come in a little bit more. Is it gap or is it perfect? Got to pull. So I can't, so I can't, definitely can't get it unless you, <clears throat> when you are uh, just like a shoe part, when you do the top, you know how to allow me to, um, I'm holding it. Right, right, ooh. Y'all see that? Cool. 
when you get help, no cap. So what I'm doing is, it's, it's stuck now, it's definitely stuck. But look how long my strings is. Um, And what I like to do is, let me back up a little bit more for y'all. Let me give y'all a good spin around again. A good spin around again. What I like to do, I take my string and I come across it. I just come across it. I keep coming across. I take it. <laughs> and then I come across again. If you can tie it, that's good. And this is what I do. I tie it just like that, though. And listen, if you can stand to wear, I say, even if you can wear it for at least three. Give me a good three to five hours sometimes, just depending on how I feel. Because time do be um, passing by, and I end up be having it on all day long. And so I like, like I said, I like to bring it down a little bit. Woo! Just a little bit so y'all can see that definition. A real hard, still born corset. It's hard. It don't bend. Like I told y'all, I even took mine in. Because uh, after 2015, of course I was big at first, so I just took my size in. I would, I, you know, I sew, so I definitely take my size in and, 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 and keep snatching. So yeah, so you don't have to go purchase and downsize. No, you just get somebody that know how to sew and keep taking it in. I take my underwear and I just pull it right over. And you have a silhouette for today. So yes, if y'all like my videos and y'all want to continuously to see me waist train, follow me, like, comment, share, and subscribe. Tell me what you think and ask me uh, any questions that y'all would like where I get it from and I'll do another video. Thank you and have a blessed day.